Hello everybody. Today we're going to learn how to introduce ourselves saying our name, our age and how we're feeling. So we're going to, hopefully you've watched the first video um, where you'll learn how to fingerspell and all of your numbers which we're going to need today to say our names and our age. So first thing we're going to do is learn how to say our name. So to do that you're going to need to use your alphabet. So you don't, uh, what we'll do is we just spell out the name when you're introducing yourself to someone. So if I was signing out Shackleton I would do each letter at a time S H A C K L E T O N okay and then once you get to know someone you could have a sign name so I know someone whose sign name is pig because she likes pigs um, and you get to choose your own sign name um, a lot of the time or sometimes someone will give you a sign name based on a distinguishing characteristic or a like dislike so I like my sign name to be singing because singing is one of my favorite things to do so to actually say your name rather than just spell out your name you need to let them know that you're going to be telling them your name so we're going to sign name so you've got two fingers on your dominant hand so if you're right-handed use your right hand which would be that one if you're left-handed use your left hand which would be that one okay two fingers it's going to start with the back of your hand facing the person you're talking to or in this case me and it's going to start on your forehead and then you're going to twist it out so that your palm is facing the person you're talking to name me and uh, because in British Sign Language we don't say things in the same order you'd often sign the most important sign first and in this case the most important sign is name because that's the subject that's what you're talking about your name so name me and then you'd sign out your name okay so I'm gonna give you an example and then let you have a bit of a practice my example is letting you in a bit of a secret so see if you can work out what my name is okay so have a go name my and use your finger spelling to spell out your name pause the video have a go and I'll see you back in a minute Okay, how did that go? Brilliant, well done everyone. So once you've told them your name, you might want to tell them your age. Okay, and to tell them your age, all you do is come from the nose. Okay, so your forefinger starts on your nose and you're gonna come out with your age. Okay, so yours will be either eight or nine. So you start on your nose, you either come out to eight or you come out to nine okay and you don't need to say me at all because if it comes from the nose it's automatically ages okay so again I'll let you in another secret I'm gonna sign my age see if you can work it out okay and if you want to ask someone how old they are all you do is start from the nose and you wiggle your fingers as you come out because we know that's age and if you're wiggling you're asking their age and if you want to ask someone their name I forgot to do that one you just go name you okay so have a go at signing your age from your nose either eight or nine for the year fours if you're another year group watching this make sure you've watched my other video to um, so that you know what number to sign for your age. Okay, pause the video, have a go, and we'll come back together. Brilliant, well done everyone. So last thing we're going to do is we're going to talk about how we're feeling, our emotions. And to do this, we're going to need to know quite a few emotions. I've actually made a little list so I don't forget any of them. So, <clears throat> some different things you might be feeling. We could have sad. 
okay and it's really important so practice these as we're doing it remember to use your dominant hand and it's really important with sign language that we use our face to help us because if you're smiling and signing sad it's a bit confusing okay so you need to make sure your face is showing whatever emotion it is that you are signing so if you're sad make your face really sad and you sign it sad and then if you're happy make sure you're smiling you're happy so happy is almost a bit like a clap but not quite you make sure our fingers are apart so it's not like this it needs to be at a bit of an angle and just tap them happy you can also be excited so again make sure you're showing excitement in your, on your face you're excited you might be nervous try nervous angry cross angry again with your face you're angry you might be grumpy grumpy or you might just be fantastic you're just fantastic today oh you might be meh bit of nothing okay so practice each of those as much as you want you can rewind the video, practice them again if you want. And then to say how you're feeling, you just sign me happy. Okay? And if you want to ask someone how they're feeling, you'll go, how are you? So you start on your chest, both hands, and you kind of like swoop out and put them into thumbs up. How are you? Okay? So what i'd like to see is i'd love to see a video of you telling me your name your age and how you're feeling okay i'd love that so if you can video yourself signing those things and send them over to me on my email address i'd love to see it all right have a good day and enjoy your signing bye